Saturday mornings with Glenn and Neil, only on Money FM 89.3. Welcome back to Saturday Mornings, the last few minutes of the show. And joining us in the studio, we are so happy to have Lin Li Fu and Ryan Huang from The Breakfast Show. Good morning, guys. How are you doing? Good. Thank you for having us, guys. I, Good I morning. I didn't know you guys would be awake on a Saturday morning <laughs> after doing Monday to Friday, 6 to 9 a.m. Huh? Anything to be on Glenn's show. <laughs> I'll wake up early. All right. Believe it or not, I woke up at 5 this morning. <laughs> oh, pretty close to us. And But you guys are on for a special reason. We always like to... Uh, you know, to let folks know what's happening in the week coming mm. up. And this is budget week that we're coming into here in Singapore, a massive uh, amount of uh, different segments that are happening during the weekday shows, uh, special events that you're hosting and, and emceeing at and interviewing in. Mm -hmm. So uh, perhaps, Ryan, maybe start off, tell us what, what's uh, special from the breakfast show this week for you guys? Yeah, so we've got a couple of things lined up. So just to give you a bit of an overview of the new show. So it's been the myself and Rachel, and to give you a glimpse of what we have on the show every morning, we have a couple of new segments we'll come up with, like Breakfast Bites. Mm -hmm. And this is where we talk about stuff that might be interesting, you know, stuff you can use in your small talk, you know, those quiet moments before a Zoom meeting or yeah. in a conference nice. room. Mm -hmm. So stuff you can use, not just to be informed, but also be entertained. And things would be, for example, how we talk about the sushi terrorism case mm. um, last week where people were just licking pigs. Yes. All right, and I want you to hold that thought. Lin Lee, <laughs> okay. we're going to bring you in in just a second, but first this quick announcement. The Singapore Civil Defence Force and Singapore Police Force Joint Open Mobilisation Exercise is now in progress. Two SCDF units and two SPF units with the following code words have been activated. Sunfield, Bold Blossoms, Defender, Black Ninja. On being alerted to the mobilization message, all personnel from the activated units must report to their mobilization base immediately at once with their personal equipment. NS men who wish to inquire more about the exercise should contact their respective division headquarters for additional information. All right, and we are back with Lin Li Fu and Ryan Huang from The Breakfast Show. It was 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. every day of the weekdays uh, on Money FM. And Lin Li, uh, So we were what just else? talking yeah. about the, hmm. some new elements of the show. Yeah. Um, apart from Breakfast Bites, which uh, Ryan mentioned, we also have What You Need to Start Your Day, you know, hmm. a few things. But we always start with um, headlines from the Straits Times or the Business Times, the key um, headlines that people would need to know to start their day. And some interesting things like, um, I know, I think it, there was uh, one about 47-year-old grandmother. Mm. And then, oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so if you're lazy to read the papers, we'll yeah. do it for you. Yeah. 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 So you get some Singapore stories in That's there. Right. In addition to the business, the finance news, people need yeah. to start their day. And I'll throw a few dad jokes here and there. So we're covering <laughs> yes. the ACS move to Tenga. <laughs> You've and... been watching our show then, haven't you? We've <laughs> <laughs> been trying. We are the kings oh. of dad jokes. So a couple of wine liners here and did, there. No? Did you hear... Uh, Ryan's that joke of the week. No. Yeah, so Please they're moving tell. from Bakaro to Tenga. Yep. So the West is yet to be. Uh, <laughs> the best is yet to be. Uh, Stick right. on the breakfast show. <laughs> <laughs> really? This, yeah, this is, I mean, that is a seismic shift, right? For, yeah. for ACS, yes. right? And that's a big one. Big one, big yeah. one, of course. Not only that, yeah. they're yeah. taking in girls from 2030, which is a big thing for you know, parents of girls who might want to The world is changing. Schools, the world yeah. is changing. So budget week uh, mm. coming up this week. Uh, what's the special? For us. Yeah. So huge. next week, we've got a couple of things lined up. And if you go to our Money FM website, all details are there. So I'll just give you a bit of a preview. Okay. So in the lead up to it, we've got UOB. Mm -hmm. Tell us why they think the 9% GST level might actually be shifted back. It's supposed to come back come on in 2024. Back to eight. There's a case for it to be pushed back. No. Wow. A bit later. <laughs> a bit later. Not back to eight percent. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, and then of course the big one will be the panel we have at the UOB Atrium, and that's where we have Mr. Injani Raja alongside oh, okay. UOB KPMG as well as the uh, Association of Small and Medium Enterprises. When when is that one? That's on Thursday, on five p.m. 15th of uh, February, right? Yeah. Post, It'll be 16th, post 16th post of February, Thursday. Oh, Thursday. Yeah. yeah, so that's going to be at UB Atrium at 5 p.m. So if you're on the area, come and say hi. If you've got any burning questions, we'll try to put it up on stage. Yeah. 
Great. And how are you finding it generally amongst yourselves, the camaraderie every morning, Monday to Friday, breakfast <laughs> show? Because Glenn and I can't stand each other. We just, we, this is all an act. We put up with us just because we, we just have pretend. to. Yeah. Interestingly, we all know each other. Oh, good. Yeah, from the time when we were in another company. Other, other lives. Company, yes, in our other lives. Yeah, so Ryan probably wanted to tell them something about how he used to <laughs> yeah, I used to work with Lynn a long time ago, and I grew up watching it on TV. Yeah. So here we are working Sounds together so now. Old. <laughs> yeah, that does kind of that does maybe maybe right, need you to look rephrase that. Young or you look exceptionally <laughs> old? I can't, I can't decide which is which here. That's hey, fabulous. I, and I, I don't I don't want to embarrass her, but I really Rachel Kelly is also in the studio with us, yes. taking photos from behind. Yeah, will you just step into camera and wave to everybody, on, Rachel? Because you're an integral part of that team. Good morning. Hi everyone, where am I looking? Hi. Now is the full Hi. team. Hello. Breakfast with Lindley, Ryan, and Rachel. Yeah, yeah. we can't leave out the producers as well because every second and every minute on air takes a lot of hard work, you know, booking your guests, the strategizing. Right. You know, it's almost like a performance. Yes. Like, and, and they've been great, Kai Ching and Amphia. So after every show, they go and have a look at how our podcasts are ranked. So they've really been pushing. And we did a wonderful interview this week mm -hmm. on ChatGPT, where we got ChatGPT to create the questions right. for our tech specialists, which was right. interesting. <laughs> yeah, so They weren't better than the questions you would give, though, right? <laughs> yeah, there you go. Okay, we don't want you guys replaced by ChatGPT or yeah. Bard or, yes. uh, or Jasper Ernie or, or Ernie, any of them, yes. right? Yes. I, I've been playing with Jasper AI quite okay. a lot over the last four or five months. And just, you know, just kind of seeing what the tech would be. This was before the chat GPT thing started. And I'm, I'm amazed at the strength and the power of that. And it's not, you know, it's not perfect. It's not a replacement mm -hmm. in my opinion. Mm -hmm. But boy, what an interesting. What and an speaking interesting of dad thing. jokes, so yeah. following Ryan's epic dad joke, we actually asked ChatGPT if it could come up with a better dad joke dad than Ryan. Ryan, yeah. I'm, Ryan I'm, won. Okay. Ryan won. Uh, okay. okay. We'll be the judge of that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, guys, we are so happy to have you uh, come in today. Uh, Rachel brought croissants, so thank you for that. Uh, but please do, this week especially with the budget, uh, listening, I think, to Money FM all throughout the day is going to be very, very important and useful for folks. But start it with the breakfast show with Lin Li Fu, Ryan Huang, Rachel Kelly. Uh, and thanks, guys, for uh, giving us a little update on what they can expect this week. Thank you for no having worries. us. Thank Good you. luck, guys. Good luck with the budget. Thank you. Fantastic yeah. thank you. Beautiful thank you. to have you with us. All right. Thank you.